Sunshine Stitchers. Welcome. I'm EJ. I'm Gary. And I'm Celia. And my eyes are down here. <laughs> Do you want to at least introduce everybody to our special guest? Oh, yes. This is Merman. He's from Tilton Craft. He took about nine months to stitch. Yeah, and he's gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> well, first, uh, today we just like to thank everybody uh, again for watching, subscribing. We want to thank all of the floss tubers who have given us shout outs. Oh my I God. mean, it's, ah. the community is amazing, and we are so happy yes. to yeah. be a part of really, this. Really, really embraced in the yes. community. Thank you so We're much. Awesome. We have an awesome community. Yes, yeah, yeah, we do, we do. Um, and so we have had several comments. Um, please comment freely. Um, all of us read the comments mm -hmm. uh, and uh, respond. And respond. Sometimes you get multiple responses response, yeah. from yeah. us. It's all good. Yeah. Sometimes from uh, Gypsy King Stitcher. That's me. Yes. yes. And I'm EJ Creates. And and I always respond through Sunshine, Sunshine Stitcher. <laughs> <laughs> and I do too. Sometimes. Um, G Moss. G M O S. <clears throat> would like to know if we kit each pattern separately or do we keep a master group of floss that we just pull from as we need it okay I'll start I have a master floss list of DMC but I don't want to mess that up so I, <laughs> so I buy floss at kit <laughs> I've heard it all now. <laughs> this is my collection. You can't touch you can't, it. No, it's complete. Why would you want to mess a complete collection? That's crazy. So when I look at, when I buy a new pattern and I'm ready to stitch it, I'm like, oh, okay, I have to go to the cross-stitch cupboard and get these flocks okay. for these particular. All right. I'm, That's I'm, not crazy, is it? No. I'm probably one no, step crazier. Really. Okay, what's yeah. yours? Um, I have... A whole set of DMC, and I've got a lot of the weeks and the um, the, the other overdyed floss. And uh, it depends on how many flosses are in the pattern. I might be too lazy to go pull them out of my drawers, <laughs> out of my cabinet, and then I'll just go buy a new floss. Or I'll go through, and if there's not a full, I bobbinate. If there's not a full bobbin, I don't pull the bobbin. I just buy a new floss. Mm -hmm. Right. <clears throat> and I have what I would like to think is a full set of DMC, multiple skeins of some colors. I think I found I had one color one time, 640 something. Uh -huh. I had 10 skeins. Whoa. Of the six, I know, I have no idea how that happened. <laughs> um, we know. <laughs> but I do tend to buy floss for each uh, project that I'm working on because I like to have everything completely together. Mm -hmm. So I can pick up a project bag, mm -hmm. open it up, and just start stitching. And that's my goal, is to do that. That's why we spent that day kidding yes. stuff up. I like to pick up a project bag and have everything in there. Yes. yes. Um, my only thing is, after I finish stitching, I've still mm -hmm. got the thread and the pattern in the yeah. bag, yeah. and then I just toss the bag. And I have one of those, um, I have a couple of those, uh, photo boxes yes. and I just put the floss in the photo box. I'll get back to it later and resort it out. So well, I know in December I decided my, my craft room was a total disaster. <laughs> total disaster. I just I tend to when I finish a project I take all the floss and I have a little paper bag that hangs <laughs> off a hanger in a closet. Okay. And which is nice because it kind of gets it out of the way. Mm -hmm. But I had gotten too lazy to even do this. I had a paper plate on my <laughs> stitching table, and I just started tossing floss onto the paper plate. The floss was falling off the paper plate. Oh the gosh. paper bag in the closet was full. <clears throat> so I took a couple of days in December. Literally, a couple of days yep, in it, December. It takes days to resort it. And, and resorted it all out. And I felt so good and so relieved. So the answer to your question is, mm -hmm. uh, we um, each have pretty significant um, uh, supplies of floss with the different um, designers. And EJ's getting there. Yes. Oh, and for my um, 
Victoria model samplers. Yeah. Because it's a, there are one offs. Yeah. I just put it in in the kit, and then um, you'll okay. figure out. I'll put it back mean. when I'm done with it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Um, but we when we're starting yeah. to starting and kidding a project, <clears throat> we make sure we have all of the flaws together. Mm -hmm. Right. And I do pull from my collection of DMC, and inevitably, a pull. Uh, be in the process of pulling a project together, and there's one color I don't yeah. have. Yeah. I, 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 there's always always one color. Yeah, out of the hundreds of skeins <laughs> and colors of DMC. Wood trail. Oh. Hey, hickory sticks. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's just name the popular, whatever the popular color is. That's what yes, you're missing. exactly. My school of thought is, oh, it's close enough. This brown is close enough. Yeah. <laughs> mm, uh, no, no, not yeah. 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 That's why I have a problem doing color conversion. Mm. Unless I, I, it really conflicts with my fabric, uh, and yeah. I really want to use that fabric, yeah. I will change. Yeah, yeah. Three Oak Stitcher would like to know more about Gary's stitching technique. I don't know, Shalika said it was like this. <laughs> <laughs> it is. I, I, I just stitch one, one X at a time and whatever is comfortable for me. I, for DMC as well? Everything. Oh. Everything. Because I get confused when it's going, you know, uh, it's like, oh, uh, forget it. I just, and I don't count that much. I start and I say, okay, I got to stop over here somewhere. And then I, so if I don't have to count, I don't count every stitch. Yeah. Yeah. So you're like one of the things like, okay, I have 12 stitches here. The next line has 10 stitches. I'm just so one ab below it, two below it, and then stitch till it's two less. Gotcha. So, yeah. So you don't, okay. That works. That makes sense. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So maybe that's the speed. That's yeah. But I stitch about four hours a day during the week. So mm -hmm. that's, that's and, consistency. And maybe 10 stitches on Saturday. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Lewis Runcy wants to know where to get Halloween Town and Christmas Land. Um, Christmas Land is from, you can get it on uh, Kitten Stitcher's website. Halloween Town, everybody, let's ask for it. Come on, Teresa. <laughs> Please. <laughs> I, I see another adventure for her cat dog shelter. <laughs> it, it's a really a nice piece. I like it. He also uh, asked about long dog samplers. He likes the one with dragons. Um, and he asked if I was uh, interested in doing the dragons of Sumatra. I like that particular chart. I've sort of ogled it for a long, long time. Mm -hmm. But I can really only handle one long dog <laughs> sampler. That's at like one a time. hate. That's, yes, yeah, it's, it's a major commitment. And this is my first. Mm -hmm. So I'm not likely to start another one for, for quite a while. Um, and I have something about, but not on this. Okay. Oh, ladies of the night. He also asked. I, I oh, ladies know, of the night. Ladies of the night. Yeah. He wanted to know where we no, can get the off. ladies of the night. Oh, yeah. and, huh? Huh? I'm sorry. She's being <laughs> inappropriate. Oh, ladies, <laughs> ladies of the night. You can order that through. Through our, um, it's called Ladies' Night. Oh, Ladies' Night. <laughs> ladies of the oh. Night is completely different. <laughs> I was going to let her go with it. I just, like, oh, my she was, God. She was on a roll. <laughs> <laughs> okay. She's the only thinking. Yeah. yeah uh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Karen, Karen at the Cross Stitch Cupboard said she was able to get it for people through distribution, right? Yes. Okay. okay. Yes. <laughs> Well, I just want to make a point. The one witch that we're all going to start stitching is the one who's the flasher. Mm -hmm. So that's why I think of the chart. She's a ladies of the ladies night. Ladies of the <laughs> night. <laughs> She's a flasher. Yeah. Uh, uh, Ash Craft, 1953. How do you decide fabric sizes when you're building a stash? Like size, oh. how do you select, if you're building That's a good stash one. of uh, fabric, how do you? I, I did it by trial and error. The <laughs> first time I signed up for Fabric of the Month, I, I went for 13 by 17 for the, and I did that for about six months and none of my patterns would fit on anything that I got. Mm -hmm. So I said, okay, I gotta go to the next size up. So I'm at the next size up. 
I think it's like 17 by 26. That way, if I do have some smaller ones, I can cut it in half or, or cut into different sizes. I think 17 by 26 is probably the best size for, for what I stitch. Mm -hmm. And then that rare occasion, mm -hmm. like the uh, Snow Queen or something like that, you need something bigger. You just have to order that when you find it. I'm, um, I'm, I just started building my fabric stash and I started with um, a fat quarter, which is 17 by 26. Yeah. And my way of thinking was the same thing as Gary's. If I needed something smaller, I would cut it out. If not, m most of my things fit into a 17 by 26. Or unless you're at the, when you're at the LNS and there's some mm -hmm. other person looking, eyeballing your fabric, you say, I want the whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I want the whole thing. We do a lot of that. Right, right Kathy? Yeah. <laughs> Yes, we do a lot of that. Uh, I tend to look at the type, think about the types of patterns that I, I select to stitch. Mm -hmm. I don't do a lot of the fairies and princesses, so I'm not looking for a super colorful fabric. I do a lot of samplers and primitive. Mm -hmm. So most of the time I'm looking for beiges, grays, pale blues, not too dark. I also know that I prefer stitching on 32 count. I will, of course, stitch on 28 count, and I've been expanding recently because I got a great magnifier lamp into 36 count. Okay. Uh, so those are the kinds of things I kind of try to take into consideration when just looking at an array, uh, an assortment of uh, fabric. I will every now and then go buy a more brightly colored piece just specific yeah no just in case okay in case. i get wild <laughs> yeah I, I, get, I go through uh color phases where i'm like always picking blue yeah. or blue and green yeah. because of like mermaids and fairies you can do them in blue and green and then you go through a little bit of yellow pink is hard color <laughs> hard color for me to stitch on because i can't pick too many things i got something today that i'm going to show you but it's really not a pink pink, but it's close, but far and few, but my greens and blues and uh, now some browns for the non-primitive stitcher that I am. <laughs> <laughs> uh, did anybody see any floss tube this week? Anybody you want to shout out? Uh, I've been watching, oh, sorry. I've been watching a ton of Sammy J stitches. Yeah. She yeah. did, um, <clears throat> she did Vlogmas. So I watched the whole of that. She did um, how what she was planning for 2019. She did her, she did a, a two hour thing with um, Jesse Marie. Mm -hmm. So I've been watching a whole lot of that. Mm -hmm. And then, um, yeah, yeah, for me anyway. Yeah, I spent New so. Year's Eve with uh, Jesse Marie for two hours, watching her floss too. <laughs> <laughs> um, Golf Coast Stitcher, I watched her, she's one yes. of my favorites. Of course, Bam and Steph, yes. uh, Buckeye Stitcher, I watched hers, yes. I saw the, her, the latest her, one. her cats, her, yeah. new, her new kittens. She Go named them. Zero to four. <laughs> <laughs> Is that like zero to 60? <laughs> but I like the name Gray Baby. I love that name. Yeah. Go ahead. I missed her this week. Oh yeah? Yeah. yeah. She just got a new one, yeah. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. All right. And then uh, many, many more. I, I Luckily, I have a long commute, so I just let them play and listen to them in the car. And then you come back and watch. And then, I, then I come back and watch them again. So, so you're getting like double, double, double points play. for me. <laughs> Replay. Because I got to see, what was that that they stitched? Yeah. <laughs> uh, and in particular, we want to thank Gulf Coast Stitcher mm, for yes. her amazing uh, shout out and acknowledgments this week. Uh, wow. Yeah. Thank you. I was floored. <laughs> <laughs> so much. I mean, yeah. just like, awesome and incredible. And we all watch. Yes. Uh, so it's, it's fabulous. Yeah. Most of them I've been watching since day one. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Like the Pam and Steph when yes. they were on their porch and it was dark and you couldn't see. Oh, yeah. And, first and episode. Yeah. Though. And then yes. I think Julie's, I think she was in front of some windows or something yeah, with the boats of, yes. or something like yeah. that. That's what's coming to mind. Yes. And, and then she had to change location. Yeah. 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 I always love the first videos. Yeah. <laughs> I, I want to shout out Handwork Maniac. Okay. Her fifth video, uh, she does, uh, it's called House and Garden Sampler Saga. I recommend that you watch it. It's a very touching piece that she 
did, she uh, incorporated, it was a piece with a lot of houses, but she incorporated houses that she had lived in, oh. her house of worship, yeah, and and uh, her, like her grandparents' house, or her, uh, you know, it was just an amazing nice. okay. piece. Yeah. And then around the side near each house, she stitched the name of what it what it is. Okay, uh, oh. it's it's an amazing, uh, watch that one. wonderfully stitched. I, I love listening and watching every second of it. Oh, wow. um, okay. So I uh, hand work maniac yeah. her okay. fifth video. Fifth one. All right, I'll start at the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> I, I also want to uh, shout out to Bev Love. She's a member of Soulful Stitching, mm -hmm. and she's in Year of Whips uh, 2019. Uh, she watches us. Oh, hi, Bev. And uh, so, yeah, hey, Bev. <laughs> hi, Bev. I don't know you. Hi. <laughs> She's on Soul for Stitchers? Soul for Stitchers. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. You're in that group, aren't you? You're, yeah. You're yeah. Whips? No, no, I don't do Year of Whips because I would be. Group. I would, but you're yeah. in the group Soul for yeah. Stitchers. Yeah. Not in the Year of Whips challenge. I can't limit myself. To yeah. <laughs> so, we again thank you so much for your comments and questions, yes. uh, for your shout outs, and um, please just keep it all coming. Yep. Yes. You know, we love you and we love you everything yes. about <laughs> this experience yeah, so that, cool that's awesome all right so who had some finishes this week not me not i said the fly i might have had a little bit of finishes oh uh i did some uh get me out of order here did me some uh new year's eve finishes uh <laughs> This was almost done earlier this year, but I wanted to wait for to finish it for nice. New Year's Eve. Just had like 30 beads to put in. But it's the New Year's Eve Fairy from um, Mirabilia. It's a wow. kit. And um, I changed her shoes to hot pink <laughs> because she's on this mauve pink color. This is my one mauve pink color. I like it. And, uh, I love that fabric. And so now I need to, I want to find a big clock to put her in. Clock? Yeah. Oh, because she's a New Year's Eve. Right. Oh, and this is 32 Lugana Roseland by Under the Sea Fabric. Yeah, this was a fabric of the month. That's beautiful. And then Can my. You see her? Yeah. Thank you. And the sparkle. Ooh. And then my next uh, nice. finish. This was I just had to put beads on it, and this says I'll be back next year. I figured this was fitting to be my last uh, finished project <laughs> for uh, 2018. <laughs> That's cute. Uh, Okay. Now, the piece that I stitched with um, Jessie Marie is this piece right here. I did the whole beard, the face, the hands. God, it was a long two hours, but I enjoyed it. I didn't even watch it again. It was so good. What do you so, do about the eyes? Um, the eyes, I, there's a ton of backstitching on him, so he's really not finished. Oh, okay. And there's some uh, words here. Oh, but, okay. Uh, okay. Backstitching, I'll have to get back to. I'm still got to figure out what I'm going to do with the eyes. Okay. Uh, I was thinking Beans, little, little black buttons. Oh. Oh. Those little bitty black buttons, yes, I think, would be yes. kind of cool. Okay, very cool. But the only ones I had was one orange and one black, and I didn't think that would be oh, appropriate. Okay. Well, let's not overlook uh, uh, something. So, EJ, where have you been for the last couple of three days? Oh, <laughs> Yeah, where's I mine? haven't been stitching a lot because I've been to Disney World. The house yes. of the Mouse. Yes, it was so much fun. So much very fun. Very good. Yeah. yeah, I took. Oh, we took the nieces. The mm -hmm. nieces took my nieces, and they had a blast. Oh, good. The Dumbo, of course. Mm -hmm. yes. The teacup. Yeah. So mm -hmm. classic. Any classic. Disney cross stitch? Um, I stitched on some oh, things, on some. Okay. but no Disney. I went to the store and I was like, "Do you have any cross stitch?" Like, oh, that was so Yeah, I don't okay. think they do that anymore. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. All right. So, how about starts? Who started starts. something? Oh, I started something. Okay. okay. Let's see your start. I started. Da 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 da. Mother Moon. Do you guys see that? There's All a, that stitching right there. Right there. When did you start it? <laughs> Well, it was supposed to be for my new year, new start, but I was so excited I started it early. Okay. Yeah. And that's the, the the her nose part and her brow. Okay. Yeah. So all you see that uh, we have We'll have a picture that we'll show. Yeah. yeah. So you see but it. I'm so yeah. excited yeah. and I love stitching her. Yeah. Okay. So I can't wait to and stitch it, some more. And that will really pop out once you get some of the other colors. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So far it's blue on blue on uh, grayish. It's a good. It's a good <laughs> <laughs> right. um, 
I had two new starts. All right. So I started Christmas Land, and this is what I got Ooh, done. Nice. Oh, you got a lot done. Yeah. How long? I, I stitched about a day and a half. Nice. On that. That, that was um, the 29th and 30th, I think, of December. Oh. I wanted to start it before the, the, end, of the, the end of the year. Mm -hmm. And then uh, since I was up at midnight, I watched the ball drop. So I said, well, it's 12.01. It's time to start my, <laughs> remember, plan, plan, plans. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It says day one, have carrots. And I started day one, have carrots. Look at that. Nice, look carrots. At, look at those carrots. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> don't even go there. They are carrots. Can't take her anywhere. So anywhere. You, can't, you cannot take her anywhere. By the way, my eyes are down here, ladies. My <laughs> eyes are down there. Okay, all right. So that's not too bad. I just got to do the bunny and then the carrot tops. Yeah, yeah, we should have done those carrots. The, carrot the, the carrot tops are going to be really cool because there's a Smyrna cross is all in the carrot Ooh, tops. Oh, right? cool. That's going to be really yeah, nice. Yeah, it's going to go fast. Yeah, yeah. And, and then. That's all my new starts. New starts. Okay. And tomorrow, well, we'll talk about, we'll talk about plans. plans. Okay. Um, I also started uh, Christmas Town. Christmas Land. Christmas Land got me all confused. <laughs> oh, you went a complete different direction than really you did. Pretty. Or did he? Or did you? I no. Yeah, I picked the color that Deb, Deb and I have the same color. Oh, okay. Oh, I think it's the blue fabric. Uh, yeah. I'm using uh, conversions of. Um, Victorian model sampler, and I will also be using two of the new sparkling DMC, the seat tones. Okay. And this is being stitched on 32 count Lugana. It's called Blue Breeze, and I originally bought it from my local needlework store that was in Laurel, Maryland back in the 90s called oh, Stitching oh, Pretty. It's since it's a, closed. It's a pretty color, and it lasted all that time. Years. Right. Yes, yeah. Oh, okay. I see the glitter. Okay, so you to the tree has got some of those yes, new DMC sparkly. sparkly. Yes. I don't know if it'll pick it up. But I'm using yeah, yeah both colors in the trees. In the trees? Oh, both. Is it this other tree too, or um, just this dark green one for now? Okay. There are a couple of other trees. Yeah, I'm, I'm using oh. the, I'm using the called called for. Let's pull mine. We'll let to, sure. I'm doing the called for colors, and some of my colors don't seem to are a little different. Yeah, mm -hmm. they're a little bit different, and they're so. We have a side by side comparison. Look at that. Yeah. And you may have a three sideways whenever, you know, finish yeah. my And uh, <laughs> the house colors are pretty pretty right on there. But I like your green for your tree. Yeah. But I think with my fabric the the brown the mm -hmm. muted one will work. Yeah. 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 Okay. So that was that's what I have today for nice. a new start. Okay. With okay. your whips? Whips. Today at the cupboard I worked on the Tempting Tangles um, Lock of the Month Club mm -hmm. Mystery Sal last year. It was called Swans and Shears. Okay. Uh, it's stitched on 32 count Madonna called Spring Meadow Green. It was also a piece that I had in my stash for quite a bit of time. I do have a picture of the finished piece and we can put that up. Okay. Cool. So, so you like you like stitching on the Lugana even weave with those quicker patterns? Or? Um, you know, easier, I don't even notice? notice. I kind of match it to, you know, fiber colors, okay. threads, and color fabric, and yeah. take it from there. And sometimes I'm stitching on it, and all of a sudden I say, oh, this is an even weave. Yeah, I thought I was the only one, because I was like, where's the slubs? Oh, I'm yeah. <laughs> That's gotcha. what I noticed after yeah. a while. Yes. Okay. The other um, oh. piece that I oh, worked Oh, she's going to make it difficult for me. I might have to do this. <laughs> we know how that's going to go. Like, <laughs> oh, look. Okay, it bends. There so, we go. This is All is Well. You've seen it before. All is Well by Shepherd's Bush. I love her. This was one of my starts from 2018. Uh, and it's stitched on uh, 28 count antique cotton by R&R &R Reproduction. But this happens to be a piece that I had had in my stash also for a very long time. And then you got the buttons too, the sheep, so the sheep are buttons. I, I got the, the buttons, the, okay. the, the sheep and a piece of fence All right. that will go on so there. It's really close to being finished. Just a little I'm bit really, at the bottom. Yes, since you last saw it, I stitched the blooms on the flowers on mm -hmm. the left side, this long flower 
Right. Uh, I'm all turned around. So. Over here? Yes, no. thank you. The long, the long flower, and then the two flowers next to it that have the blooms at the top. Okay. Yeah. No, I think it's this one right here. Um, by itself. Yeah, this one here. Okay. And then. Over the spirals. Yeah, and then yeah. those spirals. Mm -hmm. okay. um, so, is there a lot of pin stitches in the bottom, right? Because there's a there's lot of a lot scattered of pin stuff. Stitches, a lot, oh, yes. And then I started on the very bottom of uh, this area here. I can't see it. At, at the very bottom, yeah. which is a, more flowers in the meadow. Yeah, you can't see it. It's yeah, you can't see it. Yeah, we'll, sh we'll see yeah. it in the, in the Picture. photo that we put up. But I enjoyed this. This is a lot of starting and stopping because of the distances between the little blossoms. But it's it's a fun fun mm -hmm. stitch. I'm enjoying how it's rolling out. Okay. And uh, that's those are my whips. And now my whips. whips. Yes. Yeah. I've been um, because of the car ride uh, to and from fish. Orlando. No, I do not have a finish, but I did work on my nephew's birth sampler. Oh, very so cool. So this is the Savannah birth record. That's cute. Yes. So I worked on, <laughs> I finished, you see that little monkey? I yeah. finished the monkey a while ago. So I worked on the tree branch, or was that Next the to him? Yeah, the branch that he's yeah. hanging on. Oh no, that's the frame, the brown frame oh, around okay. him. The frame. The frame, and I started working on the sun. That's okay. right here. Oh, okay. Yes. Yeah. You're so gonna, you're gonna get a really quick win when you do the plaid. So, oh. Uh, that'll go really fast. And behind like, oh, it. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. That'll make you go faster. Yes. So yes, I'm loving this. Every mm -hmm. time I stitch on, I'm like, oh man, but it was easy. It was 14 count. It came with the kit. The threads used for the kit. So well, 14 counts perfect for like a car ride yeah, because of the bumps is. and the mm -hmm. and the lights changing mm -hmm. and everything. That's, yeah. yeah, it was awesome. Yeah, okay. yeah. All right, and now we're ready for some haul. Okay, haul. 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 Well, I got actually I, I got this last week, but I couldn't show it. Ooh. This is my Garron Toten Bag of the Month project Ooh. bag. Look at that. And I I think it's absolutely. Uh, gorgeous. Yeah, I think I love. everyone has been posting their photos on our, our Facebook page that they got their bags. It's really yes. cute. I love seeing my, I love seeing our bags in the wild, as I say. <laughs> <laughs> yes, nice. it's really great. Still yeah. waiting for a cruise ship photo of you stitching with the. Uh, it's you coming on the, on soon. The, coming soon. On the February eighth, I'm back on the water. Okay. <laughs> All right. Cool. Uh, I also took advantage of Jen's stitching niche. Her clearance sale, oh, you know, okay, not everybody has this whole plastic thing, Gary. <laughs> I can't see things. Gary. It's not the noise, it's just I want to see it so I can buy it. <laughs> <laughs> I took advantage of her clearance sale. Oh, I meant to. When is, when is it over? I don't know. I think it's still going on. Is I it? Don't know. I don't know. Okay. I bought uh, Shakespeare's Peddler uh, pin cushion. I have several stitching retreats this year. Mm -hmm. They all have smalls exchanges. And so far, I've been buying small type patterns, and I have these plans in my head of what I want to do for smalls. Mm -hmm. I, I just need to get them done. This one seems like a, like a little voodoo pin cushion or something. Voodoo? I don't know. It's got like an owl, a cat, a crown, a tree, I don't know, a strawberry. It just seems kind of... It's like all patchwork because you're stitching these little things and then sewing them on, on there. Something. Yeah, that one may not actually leave the house. Actually, <laughs> you learned like so much. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's nice. I also bought Jolly Joy Jingle. Yeah, thank you, Sheila. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, that's right. You have it, Gary, don't you? Yeah. I love oh, it. You have it because of you. Oh, yeah, I saw it and bought it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I like a little skinny Santa Claus. It's yeah. Really oh, you got fabric for her? which one? Is that a girl Santa Claus? No, I just saw it. Oh, she had it for sale, so I, I bought oh. it. You no, know, you got this. This is like um. I need you? this, but I'll use it. Yeah. Look at that pretty linen. Yes. It's all stiff. What is it? Like a wool shirt or? Vintage 32 count blue whisper. Oh, this is, I think this is like a, it's like a printed, it's like, uh, like EJ's Mother Moon fabric. It's printed. There's some kind of like blue print on there. 
I can, really like it. You can it. tell. You have to be careful. Look at the back. Yeah, the, the back, back is yes, very light. Like, mm -hmm, compared oh, to yeah, you don't careful. want to stitch on the wrong side. Right, yeah. exactly. But again, uh, to answer the question earlier, um, it, it, that's a color that I know I will use mm -hmm. at some point. Isn't this a girl? This kind right of looks here. like it. And I think so. Yeah, it could with be. the orange hair. Kind of cute. Yeah. I also uh, bought cute. Getting Old Sucks, a, ra a Raise the Roof design. <laughs> I kind of really kind of like that one. I like that one. <laughs> yeah. I, I have gotten to the point where I completely um, cherish every birthday. <laughs> Getting get to that then, point, youngins. And, and then every time you buy something from Jen Stitching Inch, she always sends you a nice free pattern for yes, the week. Yes, this one was Queen of Hearts. That was pretty cool. cool. I've seen people working on that. Yeah. I was very excited to get that. Great <laughs> job, Jen. Very nice selection. Yeah, and, and this is a pattern from uh, Shepherd's... Uh, Shakespeare's, Shakespeare's Peddler. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Really, really like that. Ooh. That's my haul. That, that's up here, right up your alley, Sheila. It is. Yeah. It is. It haul. totally is. Um, I got haul. Uh, I got a bag, too. <laughs> lucky <laughs> you. Know, I get a bag. I'm lucky, lucky. Because I have a lot of projects. And in my bag, I have put my haul. Oh. So. You didn't want us to see it. That's yeah. why. Ooh, that's so nice. I got the same thing as Sheila. Mm -hmm. Great minds, I see. Uh, it's a little boy. Little you think boy. it's a boy? And then I got my last clothesline. I'm finished. It's the Easter one. Oh, very oh cool. you do, you're going to do Peter's cotton knits. Yeah, Peter's cotton knits. That's right. right. Yeah, so. And then I got two pieces of uh, fabric from Stash Unload. Interesting story. I bought them from a friend on Stash Unload. Didn't realize it was a friend. <laughs> no, you brought you bought it from somebody and then you so, found yeah, it. Yeah, until I saw the, the, oh, the stitching. I know that person. <laughs> <laughs> so these are some. Not, really, look at these. I love, I love this what yellow. Is that? This is um, Chablis. Chal chalice. 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 Chalice from Picture This Plus. That is, but beautiful. it's really pretty. But when you look at the picture on the Picture This Plus website, it looks more pink. Oh, and that's so I would have beige. never bought it. It yeah. looked like a pinky beige. Yeah. So I would have never bought it. But this is beautiful. And that then, of course, nice. you know, like Sheila said, you know, nice base blue can work for anything. Halloween. Yes. A nice Easter. overdyed blue and sky tones. See, it might work for this one. Exactly. Actually, I think that's what it's going to go with. <laughs> yeah, oh, great. yeah? Oh, yeah. boom. Perfect. And then uh, enabling. Enabling. I am not the only enabler. <laughs> Pam, you enabled. Ooh. Pam. Okay, so I'm watching Floss Tube in the TV room, stitching, stitching away, and Ronnie's taking care of business of Garon, doing bags and everything. In the middle, he's deci he's watching Floss Tube in the computer. So I'm watching, I don't know if I'm watching, but he's watching Pam and Steph. And Pam showed this pattern she was stitching on on Christmas Eve. I was probably watching Jesse Marie. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so he found these. Pam showed this pattern, Halloween in the rain. And he said, I like this pattern. If you can get it tonight, you can have it. <laughs> Challenge accepted. <laughs> Challenge accepted. So I got it from um, the cottage. Um, what is that? Uh, uh, the cottage needlework. We'll link it in the bottom, yeah. in the bottom there. Cottage yeah. needlework. And it was electronic download. So it's really cool. So I got it that night. <laughs> the last purchase of the year. Mission accomplished. It's really cool. And it's got um, the oh, bottom nice. words are in multiple languages, so you can change your language for whatever you have. It's from Cory Better Cory. Yeah. And it matches, It's this, I like it because it matches those little kids I did in the window. Mm -hmm. Yes. It's the mm -hmm. same uh, design. Mm -hmm. That's really nice. Yeah. That so, um, do we want to, and then, uh, plans. Can we? Yes. Yes, EJ doesn't have any haul, correct? No, no haul. No, oh, no haul. Okay. I'm trying to behave because yeah. I'm trying to save money, so I'm trying to do a stitch from stash. Okay. At least for a while. For a while. Okay. And then I'll go All right. deep dive I'll into make sure purchasing. You do that. <laughs> yeah. So everybody saw the last video where I made all these plans and all these plans. And what's today? The fifth, right? The fifth of Today's January. The fifth of January. The so fifth. last night. What'd you do? Or the other night? One night this week, I was chatting with one of my friends in Virginia, 
And she said, I want to stitch with you. I was like, okay, what are we stitching? I mean, I got this queen, this, I got this um, witch bewixing pixie coming up. You got one of them, we can stitch it together. No, I want to stitch the Easter fairy from Mirabilia. And uh, I'll put a picture, we'll have a picture right in here somewhere. Yeah, yes. My director, yes. a picture of the fairy, <laughs> Easter fairy, not Gary blowing bubbles. <laughs> I saw that. You gotta be nice to oh, your yeah. editor. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so it's a mirror. It's a mirror bearded kit. It's called the Easter Fairy, and it's gonna be. Look, oh man, I, oh, I was slacking. So I got this gorgeous piece of under the seas fabric called Maria Mira. Maya. M A I A. Maya. M A I A. Maya. 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 So it's very Eastery. Sparkles, pinks, purples, greens, yellows, blues. I don't know, Leslie, must, Leslie just threw everything in there, and I think I it's really it. cool. And it's opalescent. Opalescent, so the, uh, the pattern comes with a kit. It comes with ugly brown fabric I always toss, and I mean, this is ugly, like, from the 80s brown that people used to stitch on. Hey. Well, I still don't like it. Right. And then it comes with the floss and everything, so um, I got my working copy and everything already there. And then tomorrow, I'm starting my next new project for the week. Um, it's going to be the um, zombies, and uh, again, I'm helping EJ out. <laughs> Visual cues, you guys didn't see that. <laughs> so, uh, and then, uh, so yeah, today was the last day of stitching on half carrots, so. So what are you going to do after that? Well, He's not I finished. just said the zombies. I, I have, I don't know. How long I can wait with something that I really want to stitch out there? Because Christmas Land is out there now. There's two mm -hmm. silk projects waiting in the wind. So I'm. <laughs> this is uh, going to be uh, an interesting. Uh, interesting week. Week. Yes. I'm, I may break. I may okay. break. All right. All right. Just All right. warning you, I will break. Okay. All right. So. Um, and my, I'm back on rotation. I actually am not clear what I'm stitching on this week. Uh, I took. I wound up actually with a list of 34 projects in oh. the end, yes, by the time I kept adding in. Mm -hmm. Sounds and stuff, yeah. Yes, um, and, but I only loaded 18 into Year of Whips. Mm -hmm. okay. Those are going to be my priority 18, mm -hmm. uh, for, at least from now. I decided to do priority 18 from now through April, and then after April, I'll go back to fitting in a little bit more from my 34 so I can start to work on everything. Yeah. Um, May is my Christmas stitching. Okay. Whatever I'm doing for gifts for uh, Christmas gifts. Are you making them stockings this year? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really. Shepherd's bush. <laughs> yeah, really. Um, so it's, it's back to back to that. So I'm actually very excited because I do like the pieces that I selected and I'm really looking forward to mm -hmm. it. EJ? For my um, plans, I'm part of the School of Magical Stitches and Literature on Facebook. Oh, okay. That's a new group. Yeah. Uh, I am in-house Ravenclaw. Oh my goodness. Yes. <laughs> so, um... You think I'm Slytherin? You, you pro yeah, I think you are. <laughs> yeah. How do I know? <laughs> <laughs> so... <laughs> Um, for this week's challenge, we have to stitch 341 stitches on a project, and that project is Mother Moon. That's due on the 6th of January. Tomorrow. 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 So I have maybe about 100 more stitches left. Oh, okay. okay. So I'll have my... So focus stitching tomorrow at our stitch along. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, stitch group. Stitch yeah. Group. And cool. then... Um, Along with the weekly challenges, they give you like a book to read mm -hmm. for the month. And the first book is Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, the first book. Okay, so <laughs> way I'm, too much for me. I'm happy. Oops. I'm Sorry. Right. You know what? That already cut way too much time into my stitching. Yes. That's why I stitch fast. No, the audio book. <laughs> oh. While you're stitching, you're you, listening. Oh. How do you watch all your films? <laughs> I know, I know. Balance people, balance. Uh, obviously, we're, we're not very we're not balanced very individuals. Right. So we're going to do that. Actually, it does sound exciting. Yeah. I, it's I good. Like the, I like the challenge of it. Yes, yeah. me too. And I think I'm that 
Like, oh, you give me a challenge, I want to meet it. Yes. Or and beat it. Yeah. So, yeah. That's for me. Except J Gary's challenges are ridiculous. <laughs> he wants you to finish. Oh, you finished with it? No, Gary. I didn't even start it yet. <laughs> so, yes. So that those are my plans. And then um, stitch, continuing to stitch on the birth sampler. The yeah. baby's going to be not a baby. So, yeah. Yeah. Baby's Make baby. sure yeah. <laughs> that he gets it soon. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, we have a, a, an announcement we said uh, uh, last week and a couple of weeks ago. Uh, again, thank you so much for subscribing to our channel. Yes, We've yes. Thank you. Over 1,200, almost 1,250 mm -hmm. uh, wow. subscribers. So we're really quite, quite happy and pleased. Mm -hmm. And so we have a giveaway today. Yes. For our 1,000 subscribers. For our 1,000 <laughs> sub <laughs> subscriber. Yes. Uh, a recognition. And um, so do you want to talk about the giveaway? The first giveaway that we're going to do is a gift card. I thought we were going to do them all one. It's all, well, it's it's all together. It's all. A first part. Yes. Oh, okay, got it. The first, first part. Okay. For, it's going to be one winner. One winner. Okay. And the first part of the giveaway is going to be a gift certificate to... The cross, the stitch, cross cover. stitch cover. Yes. yes. Oh, we can take it out and show Oh, it. okay. I didn't know what it looked like. Oh. <laughs> it's, well, it's yeah. Purple. Can you see it? Yeah. So you'll be able to it's come in if you're in the Florida area mm -hmm. or call in and you'll be able to purchase whatever you like. Um, floss, fabric, fabric, yeah. um, charts, charts, the whole shebang. Yes. Up to a $30 limit. Yeah. Everything over $30 <laughs> is, is on, on you. you. Yes. <laughs> and the next part of our giveaway is... Da, 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 da. A project woo, bag woo, woo. from Go Around Tote Bags. Yes. Yes. Nice. This one is, this is Boo. Boo. And it's one of the medium size ones mm -hmm. that, before we got to the jumbo size that I like. Yeah. <laughs> but these are pretty cool. Look nice. At this. And it shines. I don't know if you can see the shine. Yes, I, I see it. I see the glitter. I see it. The glitter. it. Yes. But it doesn't come off. It, it's, um, yeah, it won't stain yeah. your clothes. Yeah. Not stain, project. but you know. It won't get on your project. Yeah. 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 Like your face yeah. Stuff. And so, what do they have to do? So we do have a question, and, and please um, be careful exact. in your response. It yes. needs to be exact. And the question is... What's Gary's favorite holiday? What is Gary's favorite mm. holiday? Hmm. So please put your answer in comments. We will do as we did before. We will use the actual answer as the um, for the search, search for the search, and then pick using a random selector thing. Mm -hmm. And yeah. yeah, speaking of random selector things, <laughs> they're on project bags. Yeah, did, did you he, see that? Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, I wanted to. We did our uh, first drawing for. Um, our project bag members uh, this week. On the second, we gave away, um, out of our project members, we do a drawing, we did three mini bags. We had three winners Ooh, nice. in uh, Garon. Yes. They were the little, um, like the little um, Mickey and mini bags. Yes, yes, the ones we But they were different patterns. Yeah. yeah. They match, they actually match this bag, That they match this bag so they're the same fabric. <laughs> so uh, when you join Garon, the first month is uh, 25, and plus shipping, and then the next 11 months is 15% uh, off. And each month you get a chance to win one of their drawing prizes. Nice. And then this, in, the, in the Grime Guard, we did a drawing for the full bag. Not this bag, but um, in the beginning of the month, we show what the bag is. And this month, it's a heart bag. There's pink hearts on the outside. Ooh, uh -huh. And the picture's on our page. And um, do you want to show me the bag? I'll get my director. You know, what uh, director. I director. This is one of his duties. <laughs> Gary has a lot of Gary has a lot of people working for him. He has yeah. a director. He has an editor. Oh, let me tell you. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, hired, oh he baby. He hired the entire stitching group today. No, no, no. He did. And yeah. no pay. <laughs> <laughs> I, no pay. No, no, no. I, I I've gone from servant to a new word. No, no, no bag. <laughs> it's it's in the bottom. With the other bags, um, <laughs> it, uh, they're called volunteers. volunteers. My employees volunteers. are called volunteers. Or volunteers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here's the bag. Oh, oh. Look at this. Oh, look at that. Nice. 
Don't you want to be in the drawing to win this? You have to sign up for Gar Run Tote Bags. This is like red and gold sparkling. Oh, I see it. That's cute. And outside it's got love you, kiss me, be mine. Oh, that's so it's kind of like those very oh, convers yeah. conversation hearts. Is mm -hmm. that what you call yeah. Yes, conversation hearts. So. Oh, how pretty. pretty. That is pretty. Yes. Ooh. Okay, right. so um, just to repeat, yes. so that we're real clear, because we just sort of ran through a bunch of bags real quick. Yeah. <laughs> Our giveaway <laughs> is a Garron toting bag, toting bag. Right. And, project and a $30 gift card, gift card to, from to, the, to the cross stitch, stitch cover. Cupboard. Yes. And our question, we can put your response in comments, is what is Gary's, Gary's favorite, favorite season? Holiday. 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 Gary's favorite holiday. holiday. And by yes. the way, my eyes are down here. <laughs> <laughs> I might have to rewatch the video to see what we were talking about. We were down here, not up there. I know, Merman is pretty spectacular, I have yeah. to say. It took me forever to go through the clouds, but then when I got to the face and the tail and everything, I went yeah. really fast. Mm -hmm. It did. Well, we saw it rough for a while. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so again, we want to thank you for watching. Uh, What's our tagline? Our tagline. Oh. I don't know our tagline. Honestly, Shame Gary. on you, Gary. I, I have the memory of a fish. I <laughs> thank you for watching thank and we you. really hope that you join us again next week and no, no matter, matter where you are the sun is always shining when you're stitching, stitching. Hey, bye bye, bye. 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 bye.